Hey everyone, the moment we've all been waiting for is finally here. Dally 3 has arrived. This isn't just an upgrade, it's a game changer in text to image technology. Say goodbye to the days of wrestling with prompts. Dally 3 understands your ideas in a way that's light years ahead of its predecessor and even its competitors like Mid Journey. Available in early October for ChatGPT, Plus and Enterprise customers, Dally 3 is about to redefine creativity. And remember, the images you create are 100% yours. Let's dive in. First, we'll examine a vibrant yellow banana-shaped couch in a living room generated by both Dali and Midjourney. Let's analyze the prompt and view the results. On the left is Doll E, and on the right is Midjourney. The prompt specifies a vibrant yellow banana-shaped couch. Doll nails it, while Midjourney falls short. Both images feature a pile of colorful cushions, and both have wooden floors. However, Dal includes a rug, which Midjourney omits. Both scenes have potted plants, but in terms of sunlight filtering through the window, Dali outperforms. It looks like a sunny day, whereas Midjourney's scene appears cloudy. For this round, Dali 3 takes the win. Next, we'll explore paper craft art. Again, on the left is Dal E, and on the right is Midjourney. Dal E accurately captures the paper craft art aesthetic. Both images feature figures holding a cat, but Dali's figure seems to be giving a gentle hug. Dali also includes potted plants, which Midjourney lacks. Both figures are smiling, but overall, Dali better captures the paper craft art vibe. Let's take a closer look at these pictures. This is Dali, and this is Midjourney. Once again, Dali takes the win. Moving on, let's examine a mini-map of a cafe with indoor plants and wooden crisscross beams above. Both images look good, but Dali more faithfully follows the prompt. The crisscross beams are clearly visible in Dali's image, while Midjourney's lacks them. Overall, Dali wins this round as well. Let's take a closer look. This is Dali and this is Midjourney. You can decide the winner based on that. Next, we'll explore some modern architecture, a building with large glass windows situated on a cliff. Both images look impressive, but Dali's includes the sun, which Midjourney's lacks. In terms of design, both are strong contenders. This one might be a tie, although Dali does a better job of adhering to the prompt. Let's take a closer look. This is Dali, and this is Midjourney. Finally, let's examine images of potato kings wearing majestic crowns and sitting on thrones. Instantly, you'll notice that Dali's image includes a majestic crown, while Midjourney's does not. Dali's scene also features a more expansive potato kingdom and includes castles in the background, which Midjourney lacks. Let's take a closer look. This is Dali, and this is Midjourney. All right, folks, we've reached the moment of truth. As you've seen, both Midjourney and Dolly 3 are exceptional at generating images. But let's be real, Dolly 3 is pulling ahead in this race. Not only does it adhere to your prompts with uncanny accuracy, but it also boasts the groundbreaking ability to generate text, a feature Midjourney will launch with version 6. Sure, both platforms could potentially generate similar images based on the same prompts, but Dali 3 takes it to the next level, capturing every nuance and object you specify. It's not just a head, it's setting a new standard. And get this, Dali 3 is about to become even more accessible with its upcoming API, opening doors for third-party apps. In fact, we've got an exclusive app in the pipeline that will fully support Dali 3. So there you have it. We hope you've enjoyed this deep dive as much as we have. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe for more jaw-dropping content. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey.